Hello guys, the Creator Soldier here, and today I'm doing an update on my M24 sniper rifle. Um, so what I did so far is I glued the um, magazine release and the trigger parts to the uh, main body. Um, uh, I made the um, I uh, finished the bolt. Wait a second. Okay. So I finished that. Um, I um, made some sliding things inside the um, bolt, inside the main housing of the bolt. So um, it doesn't look very proper, but I'm going to work on that. As you can see, the trigger thing moves down, and it's the um, the striker strikes the bullet and it fires. So uh, I also have to make a new magazine because this one is not very good. You can see it doesn't have this uh, little thing that uh, holds the bullet in place. This thing is, isn't very steady so I really need to make a new one. Um, but the magazine catch does work right now. As you can see and it clicks it doesn't come out very well I have to reinforce this side because you can see it slides a little bit so I have to um, glue some uh, layers of paper on there but you can just hold it and when you do that it will drop out easily so that's um, that part um, the case I made a new one because the old one was pretty fucked up. Um, it can eject pretty good. The ejector isn't that well, so um, this one is the ejector. It's not very powerful, so um, but it works. The extractor I made that pretty good, so it can hook on to the rim of the um, bullet. Yeah, this one is, isn't very good right now. Yeah, you can see it goes like this. And it ejects when you uh, the ejector ejects the thing. Over here I made the, um, wait a second, the firing pin. You can see it's moving. Um, it isn't a very strong um, spring, so I don't know if it can strike the bullet to shoot. I found um, a World War II cartridge in my garden last week, so that's pretty cool, I think. It isn't usable, but I don't know from which gun it is. So if you have, a, if you know uh, from what gun it is, you could uh, tell me. That would be very nice. If you can see, here's um, an M16 bullet, and here's the um, one I found, so that's pretty small. It could be a submachine gun bullet or something like that. But, okay, back to the gun. Um, you can see I didn't make um, a bolt, um, bolt stop, because, um, yeah, I don't really know how to make that. I saw it in some videos of... Um, Snow face uh, 27, but um, I think I'm just going to make it a little bit easier. You can see you can turn this, but I have to make a hole for the um, bolt handle to lock in place. Um, the you can see when you pull the trigger, this will strike. You see. So when I go back with the um, the bolt and I push it forward again, the um, this thing hooks up to the trigger and when I fire it, it strikes. So that's pretty nice that that worked. Um, I'm trying to eject a bullet, but but my um, 
my ejector isn't very strong so I don't think that is going to work right now maybe later because I have to uh, tighten the spring a little bit wait let me see okay so I'm trying to eject it yeah okay it almost ejected so um, I have to work on that but it is a pretty good thing for now um, so that was pretty much my update um, I have so one thing to tell you you should buy this little pencil it, can, uh, it comes in a little box with some knives and it's very good to um, cut the paper or cardboard it's really nice it's a cutting pan it is really nice you can find it in uh, almost every hobby store or something like that the stock has to be made from cardboard I'm going to make that in two weeks because I'm going on vacation tomorrow so that's not going to work um, this week so um, thanks for watching um, please comment subscribe rate anything you like ask me a question if you want to know how something works or something like that so um